I love this little fella. This is Rusty. He came to us from the Bastrop County Animal Shelter, and he was three generations of feral. He came in on a catch pole and muzzled and pretty untouchable. But the Chihuahua Whisperer, Christine, uh, wears him down. It took a year for me to get to this point where I could hold him. And tonight, I just decided that Rusty deserves a ride on the scooter and to see a beautiful sunset. Are you ready to go, Rusty? Oh, I think he's ready to go. All right, here we go. There we go. What do you think? Just about everyone knows how sensitive a dog's nose is, but can you imagine, if you can smell in such detail, it's like turbo. He was also a five out of a six heart murmur. He's down to a three now. I may have to be the guy who has the pouch, who rides on the scooter, with the dog in the pouch for sunset rides. All right, Rusty. You want to you want to hit the start button? Feel the power, Rusty. Now, normally Rusty would wear a helmet. I would wear a helmet. We're on our private little road. I think at these speeds and in this environment we're going to be okay. What did you think of your first scooter ride? <laughs> you guys want to ride on a scooter too? Wow. Elvis, we got to work on that. Wow, look at that hummingbird. I wish you'd come around here so you could see the iridescence of this throat. They can literally flash them. Super awesome. It's okay. I know you remember me. It's weird, but it's my pouch feels empty right now. This must be what moms go through. Oh, hey, happy Mother's Day. This will be Mother's Day number two for me uh, without my mom. It's important for me to not define myself by loss. I've had loss. Many of you have, but that's not who we are. Just remember, do something good today for a mom, even if you don't have your mom. Honor them. Where'd Rusty go? Rusty? He's inside. You gotta wonder what kind of people dedicate the ground floor of their home to dogs, medical fosters, because dogs like Toby, look at him. Yeah, he's injured, but he really just needed more time and love than anything. And now, a great home and a friend for life. Great, great success stories. Uh, some of them hard. Grace, oh, wow, hard to look at, but amputation, emaciation. And now, like two months later, running like the three-legged wind. But fostering at this level ain't easy. It will pull your heart out, but it is a calling, and Christine is really good at it. By the way, Gracie, that's my aunt, by the way, in Alabama, so no one's safe. We're kind of like Amway here. We're pulling our family in now. Look at Elvis. Oh, wow. Terrible neglect case. He gets to stay here for life. Cheyenne, again, needs time to heal physically and emotionally. She found a great home. Christine, what are you doing? Oh, Maxine. Great, great home as well. So if you want to help us out, it's super simple. Just watch our videos share them and if you can get on the YouTube and subscribe to the Uncle Mullet just subscribe that makes money that helps us help animals and if you could use the YouTube link Facebook doesn't pay us anything but YouTube does it's a good thing you're doing you just get there and you watch your video you can even pretend to watch it you don't have to watch it and good things like this happen thank you I don't know why I'm talking like this but I am forget about it.